Vancouver. What's up guys? Welcome back to the channel and today we'll be doing some shooting. I just got this 22 and I want to see if the scope is on because with a new scope you have to make sure it is on. So it's a 22250 Remington model 788 and it's a bolt action. So, I'm pretty excited to shoot this gun and see what it's doing. I'm thinking about using it for deer hunting. Like I said, it's the Remington model 788-22250. We have a 3 to 9 scope on it. Let's shoot it. So, guys. I didn't get a real nice footage of the shooting, so I'll just show a few clips and then we'll just continue the video. Yes guys, so this is what the magazine looks like. It holds three rounds and this is what the rounds look like. So let's get loaded and see what's going on. So I had these bottles set up, but the wind was so strong, it blew one of the bottles down and at some point it even blew down the camera. So you guys will see that. And that's where the camera fell. All right, so camera fell. I don't know if I got the first two shots yet. So if I do, then you'll see them. If I didn't, then you'll see these. So I'm gonna go after the small bottle first, and then I'm gonna go for the top of the big bottle. Always clean up after yourself. So, yes, guys, this Remington 22-250, I think it passed the test. Pretty accurate, pretty accurate. Whoever shot this scope in did a good job. It's on point. So I think I can get this gun for deer hunting next deer season. I'm ready for deer season. I'm out here at this lovely pond. I might just go ahead and throw a couple lines and see if there is anything biting. And I might just let you guys see that as well. So let's see what happens. All right then, let's go throw some lines and see if we can catch some bass. As I got here, I saw some movement. So I'm going right there. Movements here and there. All right. We got this side now. Saw back jumping. This used to be. Just a little spot. Now it's a whole swamp. It goes all the way back. And it was just an opening right here in the front. It has a lot of lily pads. Well, you know how to work around that.
you go anywhere in these lily pads and still come out victorious oh yeah nice girl all right let's try another spot see there are so many spots out here we could just move around move around move around move around try to find one that is active 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 let's make a couple of throws right here somewhere see what's going on Whoa. This is loaded with turtles. Turtles, 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 turtles. There's a little spot up here at the end that makes this curve right here. Even this curve right here sometimes has fish. I've caught bass in this before. It all connects. I got a nice, got a nice one. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no, you don't. 
Oh, no, you don't. You don't try to get back in the water like that. No. No. That's, that's not a good practice. Ah. That's not a good practice. You know I'm going to go get you. All right, so I came to shoot and I got some food. That's enough for me. I'm going home. I almost go in the pond for this one. What can I say? I came to shoot a 22-250, which was successful. And then I decided to throw a line and got me a nice bass. It was a day well spent. So with that, I conclude the video. Thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for subscribing. Thank you guys for liking, you hear that? That's my bass. Make sure you share with a friend, leave your comments, and see you on the next video. Peace out.